to be one of the fastest growing automotive brands in Europe, Comline is a British distributor of own brand replacement parts for European, Japanese and Korean vehicles. GarageWire TV visits Comline's headquarters to reveal why independent garages can rely on Comline's fit first time ethos when it comes to its successful braking range. Priority for Comline brand is always quality. We only work with manufacturers uh, who can give us the quality level we want at a competitive price. Um, and on braking, that's very easy for us because we work and only have ever worked with one braking supplier. And I regularly go to go out to the, the factories uh, because of my technical background. I can translate quite well to them what the market wants back to what they need to produce. For the brake discs, we've got over 1,600 in range. Of those, approximately 600 are coated. And on the brake pad range, we've got over 900. We will identify to cover the sort of 95% of the market. We have access to car park data for Europe and UK. We identify the, the most popular models and we will start to develop a pad, certainly for very popular models, as soon as we can source an OE sample. That people sort of underrate brake pads in the sense of they tend to treat them as a, like a commodity. Actually, they're quite an intensely engineered product. Everyone takes it as a given. It's got to, it's got to stop the car, it's got to have good performance, it's got to last long enough. Um, and those are all aspects that we look at. But it's got to do all that uh, without making any noise, really. To keep noise to a minimum, Comline controls the formulation of friction material and also fits a rubber metal rubber shim to the back plate. What's more, depending on the vehicle application, pads may also feature chamfers on the edge of the friction material and slots in the middle to reduce stress. Well, at the factory they use uh, the huge dynamometer and that is part of the R90 process. And we also have facilities here to check friction material and uh, brake discs as well. We have our small laboratory for testing. Regulation 90 specifies the design, construction and performance requirements for brake friction material and more recently discs and drums too. The regulation sets a minimum standard to ensure these replacement parts deliver the same performance when compared to the original. However, Comline's braking range goes above and beyond and delivers what it calls R90+. Um, so this is all the testing that we do um, as a manufacturer to make sure that our product exceeds those R90 minimum requirements. It's important we do, that we do hot shear testing as well, so we do that at 300 Celsius. So we do that, which isn't an R90 requirement, that's an R90 plus test that we do. R90 doesn't have any information or any requirement around wear characteristics or noise characteristics. So we've got dedicated dynamometers there which can simulate um, the, the, the weight um, and inertia you're trying to break. And with that brake dynamometer we can do very detailed um, control testing. So we can, we can tell the brakes at what temperature to come on, what disc temperature to come on. We can tell them at what pressure to apply when we do when we when we apply the brake, and we can tell them at what we can decide what speed the vehicle's going at. Comline discs are also subject to stringent quality testing to ensure safety, reliability, and performance. Richard introduces us to the coated disc range, which has seen a massive growth recently. It's a zinc-based coating, and basically, it makes cuts down time for the installer. There's no storage grease to remove from it or oils which were traditionally used to stop them getting rusty in storage. So there's very, a, a couple of basic tests you have to do um, to, to get a pass through the uh, R90 for discs. Um, the first one is uh, just a high, tent, a high torque test. The more critical bit uh, of the R90 test is, is that you then put it through a number of thermal cycles. Um, so you basically uh, raise it up to um, different brake applications to take temperature high, let it cool down, take it high again, let it cool down, and you put it through a number of cycles. Um, and the reason you're doing that is because uh, essentially the grey cast iron, the quicker it heats and cools, um, basically you can start to form uh, cracks in the material. Brake pads and discs are at the forefront of Comline's product range and a key driver behind the brand's ongoing growth in more than 40 countries worldwide. For more information about Comline's braking range, go to comline.uk.com.